my poor garden. Hallowed be its name. I've given it the name Lucy so I could add it to the prayer list at church. You know. 7B, this isn't normal. Uh, it's very, very unnormal. Um, and a lot of our plants that we plant in 7B <clears throat> often will say that they'll be all right to zone 5. But a lot are very um, on the edge with 7, 8, 9, 10. So there's the question of what survives this nonsense but what I'm dressed in my finest farm girl attire I've got to go down to the chicken coop because I know chickens live in Alaska I know they have chickens in every part Sweden Finland of the country that don't make them country chickens now my chickens don't know nothing about this nonsense right here it's unholy so um, I've got to go check on them. I took them a lamp last night uh, that had uh, an Edison bulb in it to give them some heat. Uh, they are plenty blocked from the wind down there, so that's that's a blessing. And I think they're okay. I just want to go down there and make sure I don't have chicken sickles. So, but I've got the tape measure so we can do a, this is the official first day of snow and the snowpocalypse in the south. So, I'll measure the snow and then go check on the chicken sickles and come back. Cooper, bless his soul, he is also going to measure the snow because if I go out this door, he will be in hot poor soup. So, here we go. And I'm afraid my baby cat may go with us. And Kenny won't go. Sissy. Okay, so. Oh. How deep is it? We're at exactly five inches of snow. Never in my adult life have I ever seen this kind of, oh, huh, I forgot I was filming, seen this kind of nonsense. Oh, Koopy, what is this? Don't leave him out here. Y'all poor Cooper. It's up to my belly. Put him in. Okay, I gotta go check on the chickens before I turn into a, a chicken sickle myself. Kenny, I'm putting the gate down. Cooper ain't gonna be out here by himself. If I fall down these stairs, nobody laugh because I won't edit it. It's always funny to me too. Okay. Oh goodness. I'm telling you, Kenny and I have for a long time said we really should move a little further south because it still gets kind of cold. And that was when it was 50 degrees outside, and it's beautiful. It is. It is beautiful. You know, before we go to the chickens. I don't want to mess up the snow, but okay, so my shade garden is not looking at its best out there where the flower garden, vegetable gardens are. It's not going well. It is, it is beautiful, but let's check on our chicken sickles. Oh, this is pretty snow. I mean, let's see how the guys are doing in here. Water's frozen. Well, they're stirring about a little. It's not incredibly cold in there, which I'm surprised at. Gotta bring some warm ice or some hot water out, defrost for them. But how cold is it, guys? Okay, well, I'm going to shut the door. Keep what heat in you got. It's not bad in there. I'm surprised. I know. Oh, oh I know I'm sh showing you the door. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. Well, we're heading back to the house now. That was enough of that. And we're supposed to get this much more over the next two days. So, I'm telling you, in my lifetime, I, I can't recall a time. I think I just... I think those are my cannas. I think we can. I don't. I can't tell if I'm on the sidewalk or not. I'm not sure if they're going to come back now. And oh, let's walk over here real quick. It's so cold. I need to go in. But here's what I was concerned about. Hmm. Well, it's still trickling. So there is that. 
I guess that's as good as I can ask for right now. Oh, poor fish. Are they in there? Sure. They're in there. See these little feet prints? The cats keep pushing this open and climbing under the house where I keep all the pots that I use for planting. So, look at the steps. Oh, goodness. It's too cold for this shenanigans gates that we keep Cooper in with. Okay, that is all. It is so cold. I think I read that it was 16 outside today. And it is, it's just, it's, it's bad. All right, guys. Till next time.